sponsored by Lexus. AT&T at the half is presented by AT&T. Our game is brought to you in HDTV by HP. Coke Zero presents real fans of NCAA March Madness. There's not even a salary to debate. They're not employees. They're students. The fact is they're not employees. They're student athletes. I can't say often enough, obviously, that student athletes are students. They are not employees. You know, sometimes, like I said, there's hungry nights where I don't, I'm not able to eat, and uh, but I still got to play up to my, you know, capabilities. There are hungry nights that uh, that I go to bed and uh, I'm starving. You wake up in the morning, you have weights at this time. Then after weights, you go to class, and after class, you go, you go maybe try to grab you a quick bite to eat. Then after you get your quick bite to eat, you go straight to meetings. And after meetings, you got practice. And after practice, you got to try to get all the work done you you had throughout the day. I would love for for a regular student to to have a student athlete schedule during the season for just, just one quarter or one semester and, and, and show me how you balance that. What language did you study? Uh, Swahili. Swahili? Yes. Does that come in handy since you graduated? No, not at all. What language did you take? I took Swahili. Swahili? Yes. Do you speak Swahili a little bit? As of right now, no. I was with a friend and he said uh, that his son had a video game with me in it. Hey, you want to go and check it out? You know, so yeah, of course. Left-handed, height, weight, skin color, everything. Ball-headed, it was, yeah, it was, it was me for sure. I'm thinking to myself, wow, they got me on the video game. And while this kid was playing, he almost whispers it in my ear, like, you know, the crazy thing about this is that you didn't get paid. 14 schools out of the 1,100 last year actually had positive cash flow out of intercollegiate athletics. It's uh, anything but a money-making proposition for universities and colleges. Mississippi State coach Dan Mullen was just given a raise, pushing his salary to $4 million a year. $7 million a year for the next eight years. That's Alabama coach Nick Saban's new deal. University of Kentucky announced a $52 million seven-year contract extension with head basketball coach John Calipari. Kyle Hardrick was so good that Oklahoma offered him a basketball scholarship in ninth grade. But after a knee injury during practice his freshman year, he lost his scholarship. And with medical bills piling up, he couldn't afford to stay in school. If it was workman's comp, my son would have been taken care of for the rest of his life. He would have been able to finish his college.